I'm going to show you how to install and set up shaders for Minecraft on your PC. This is nice and easy, really fast and completely free. So the first step is to go down below into the description and from there you're going to find a link to our website. Go to that link and on the top of that page you're going to find a link which is going to take you over to Lunar Client. This is the best way to get shaders set up and installed nice and quickly and nice and easily. Once you're on this page you're going to choose whether you're on a Windows computer, a Mac computer or a Linux computer. Most of you are going to be on Windows or Mac. I'm on Windows so I'm going to click download. This is then going to download the Lunar Client on my computer as we can see it up here downloading. Once it's downloaded you're going to click open file, you're going to click I agree. This is then going to install Lunar to your computer. Just give it a minute to install and set up. Once it's finished installing you're then going to have the Lunar Client on your desktop just like this. This is going to replace your normal Minecraft launcher so you'll only launch this every time you want shaders to work. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to open it up here. Now I'm already signed in so I can see my picture at the top but if you're not signed in click up here and it will allow you to sign in. From here what you want to do is you want to click the little drop down here which is going to open up your settings page. From here you want to choose the Minecraft version that you'd like. I'm going to choose version 1.20. I'm then going to choose 1.20.4 and I'm going to click launch game. This is then going to launch my Minecraft account and open up Minecraft. Once it's finished installing it's going to say launching and starting JVM. You just want to give this a second. Sometimes it could be a little bit slow. Mine's been really slow today. So just give it a minute and then once this is finished you'll see Minecraft should open open up down here and it should begin to open. Once Minecraft is open you'll notice that the menu looks a little different to what it normally does that's because we're now on a new Minecraft client. If you hover over the little picture in the top left it should show your username just like that. If it doesn't click this picture and then it will allow you to sign into your Minecraft account. From here what you need to do to set up your shaders is click Minecraft settings in the bottom then click video settings shader packs. Now if it comes up with this message to say shader packs are not compatible with light Lighting mod, please disable lighting mod in lunar settings. That's fine. We're going to click back. We're going to click done. We're going to come down to the bottom where it says lunar settings will be the first option. We're going to click that. We're going to click mods. We're then going to look for the brightness mod. So I've typed in BRI and it's come up with the lighting here. So we're going to disable that. We're then going to close this down and press escape. We're then going to go back into Minecraft settings, video settings, shader packs. And here we can now see our shader packs. So what we're going to do from here is we're going to click open shader pack folder. This is then going to bring up up the folder where all of our shader packs are located. Now if you've done this correctly this folder will currently be empty. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move that folder to the side for now. I recommend keeping it open. Then go down below to the link in the description which will take you across to our website with lots of different shader packs on. One of the shader packs linked on our website is this one here. Silder Shaders. Now this is one of the most popular shader packs that are out there at the moment. So I'm going to scroll right to the bottom. Just an example I'm going to download this one. I'm going to click download. It's then going to download the shader pack up here. I'm then going to click the little folder icon to open up where this folder is. Then we can see in my downloads folder the shader pack here. I'm then going to drag it across into the original folder that we opened earlier called shader packs. I'm then going to close both of these windows and head back into Minecraft. From here we can see our new shader pack is now installed. So I'm going to click it and click done. I'm going to click done again, done again. We're then going to open up a new Minecraft world just to show you that this is working. So I'm going to create a new world here in creative just as a quick example for you guys to show you that I now have shaders installed to my Minecraft account. So as you guys can see, shaders is now installed and it is working on Minecraft. As you can see, it looks absolutely beautiful. It never gets old how good shaders actually looks on Minecraft. As you can see, it's absolutely beautiful. There's lots of different shader packs you can choose from, so I'd recommend checking out the link down below. But that is how you get shaders up and working on Minecraft.